Hi there and welcome back to the Dark Queen of Kryn. I am Byron and we are still in the underwater city, the underwater city of the sea elves. And we have to look for an elven girl with the name of uh, Irenia or something. Her little brother is uh, worried that she might be out there battling the dragons and she is much too young to be... Oh, actually I wanted to say yes. She's much too young to be battling sea dragons. So it's our duty apparently to try and rescue her. A dwelling room. She's not... Oh, Marauders of the Deep. Yeah, well... Do your little marauding thing. Boop. Boop. Done. End. As long as Rekaldarian gets to attack first and... Oh, Genevieve Shalik can gain a level. That's good. By all means, um, again, didn't you just get a level? Okay, so, um, that's not where I wanted to go. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Let's go to the north then. No, I, I, I will not train her right now, that's just stupid. It's just stupid, you know. More people will gain levels, and it would suck if I had to go to the training area every time. Guard room, it seems empty. Yeah, and one of those rooms, this little girl is supposed to be. I don't care. So we go to the. No, we don't go there. We move around here, and then actually, this this is rather tricky. Yeah, we we probably move to the west here. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Come and play if you if you're valorous. There are two young elf girls trying hard to be brave. The boulder of the two introduces herself as Arenia. Take them with you. Yes, of course. Oh, that's awesome. It didn't take as long as I thought to find her. You start bringing the elves to safety. Yeah, that's what we do. An old couple paddles forth to meet you. Take them to the safe hall? Yes, of course. They follow behind. Whole bunch of people is following us here, apparently. But the safe hall... Yeah, we bring the elves to safety. I know, we bring all the elves to safety. And the good news is that the safe room is just around the corner. We shout. And get in. Yay, much rejoicing. Um, okay. The boy. Is the boy glad now that we brought his sister back? Or do we actually have to enter twice because we had two kinds of people uh, with us? The elves bring before you an old priest, horribly wounded. To heal him may take all your healing spells. Do you do it? You do you do it? Yeah, of course. As you begin, his eyes fly open. No, no healing. It is my time. But I have been pondering what to do with Xorgor, my stuff. Now I know it is yours. He dies. 200 experience points and apparently we get an item. A staff. Fine, we take it. Do we need to... Uh, rest? To get our spells back? No. Worried the warden is examining the door hinge. Dragon blows have cracked it. If they strike again, the door will give way. A woman swims forward and runs her hand over the hinge. It can be replaced. There is another one in my workshop. If the outlanders will go get it, we will defend this door. Agree? Sure. The warden comes forward. Here is a map of our city. This is recorded as journal entry 64. Let's take a look. You can't see it, but it may be useful for me.
Yeah, it is. It is useful. But it's almost it's the same I have in the clue book. Well, the clue book has a little mo the map of the clue book has a little more information, but is a little more cluttered too because of it. But hell yeah, you need a map here, or without a map you're fucked. Okay, yeah, thanks. And here's a present from the Dragonesti. Wear it proudly. 66 experience points. Yoohoo. What do we get? Another ring of reaction. That's awesome. How about you take it? And equip it. Ah. Now the water no longer hinders you. Very well. The workshop is in the south eastern corner of Nolides. Gods go with you. Behind you, they block up the ruined doorway at the best they can. Yeah, I know. We have been to this uh, weapons shop, smithy, thingy, whatever. We have been there already. There was nothing going on there because the event was not active yet. Yeah, I don't give a flying fuck about those cruising dragons. If they happen to cruise next to me, they're dead meat. It's that simple actually so um, are we still on track yeah we are sort of so we go through here and down here and into this direction and to the south and that should be the forge a workshop with cold forge you have no trouble finding the right hinge and let's get back. Let's get back to bed, girl. And um, is that the right way? Yeah, pretty much so. And they have brought the hinge. The elves unlock the door. Soon the door is strong as ever. Come inside, Atlantis, and shelter with us. Doors unlocked. Yep. Anything else? Lucian swims up to you, shaking his head. Blood mists through his torn armor. Never have I, s never have I seen sea dragons so fierce. They seem determined to kill us all. I trust you have had a boring time here in the safe hall. Agree? Uh, no. You tell them no, and other elves rush to explain. Prince Lisa, these people saved many of our people. They found my mother. They were a big help. They delivered spears to our warriors. They helped us fix the safe hall door. They tried to heal our priest. Lisa is amazed. You are out of your element, yet you have done so well. I bow to you. He does. Congratulations, we gain experience. Then he looks around, as if for something missing. Captain Danner is not with you. Is he? he is not hurt? Then remembrance floods his face and deadly fear drains it of color. He is in the palace. I had forgotten that. And I was going to take you to heal him. Uh, when the dragons attacked us. Now I cannot go, he sacks a little. Nor have I any warriors to spare. You will have to go yourselves. Find him, heal him if you can. And bring him to the safe hall until we have ended this threat. Elves come and take the wounded Lucian away. Okay, the warden comes forward. Denor was in the prince's chamber when the attack began. Gods be with you. Yeah, well, okay. Okay, apparently we don't get another quest. Uh, no, actually that was the wrong button. We just have to get our friend, if you want to call him that, back. So, where do we go? Um, there's one thing I want to try though. Yeah, they shut the door and the dragon still rampage and I don't still give a flying fuck. So, I guess everybody <laughs> can live with that. Um, yeah, we want to go through here all the way. And um, up here, down here and in here. I don't care. If there are dragons in here, they're toast. Simple as that. 
What is in here though? A common room. The dragons have demolished it. Okay. Nothing too fancy. And. Oh, more orders of the deep. So there's an empty dragon and a snake and another dragon. Nobody likes them. You. I think you move away. Done and one, two, three. Oh, great. You're dead. You're dead. You end. Done and got. Oh, really? Uh. Really? Uh, 4,833 experience points. I wanted to go in there actually. Before we do that, we save. Just in case. Um That's weird. So there is a door to the west. I didn't want that actually. So if we go to the north here. Ah, that's why what I wanted. Grim Sea Elves defend this portal. Yeah, look around. Oh no, the abyss again. Oh, we don't have to help them apparently. I thought they might need help. I was wrong. Okay. So, um... Okay, we can go in here. And through those doors. And that actually is where we started uh, the whole thing here. This is where we woke up after our ship sank. And then uh, we went in here. Oh, nice fishes. And the dragons are still on a rampage. Who would have thought? The guard room is empty. Oh, really? Oh, shit. Uh, we could cast a lightning bolt because that actually works like a fireball on the water oh, sh oh you can do it that's good let's see oh there's a whole bunch of them let's see one two three I don't really know how I don't really know how big the uh, area of effect is let's see Not too shabby. Uh. And there's a little snake. Yeah, you can't get to it. You don't have enough rings of free action for everybody. And you end. 3000 experience points. No treasure though. Okay, um, let's take a look around. Um, where am I? Oh, I get. I, I remember this is where we started the whole affair. Okay, let's head to the north then. Guards room, dragons have demolished it and stand back and keep the people away from here. Dragons are at the store. We offer help. They decline your offer. Hmm. 
Hmm, weird. Okay. If you don't need my help, you're not going to get it. Let's try and visit that other safe hall again, because this is where we could actually train. I don't care. Um... Yep, we shout and get in. Yep, but there's no way for me to identify my stuff, my items. Apparently, so we save again. And uh, you, you actually train. And become a tw level 23 magic user. Sadly, no new spells for you. And camp. Magic. Do you get. Yeah! Ooh, nice. A, a third and a sixth level and a bonus spell. Yeah, next doesn't work. I know. My mistake. So, of course, you get that as a. I don't know. Six and. Oh. Uh, third. What do we want here? Stone to flash, flash to stone. What do we have? You have a stone to flash. Then you could use a flash to stone just in case. And here you take another lightning bolt, I think. And delay blast fireball. Thank you. We will not stay underwater forever, so that's cool. We rest. And you get your shit back. So Genevieve Jolie has 3.15 million experience points and is a level 23 mage. Zara White only has 3.1 million experience points and is only a level 20 white mage. White mages need more experience to level than um, red mages. That much is true. Uh, view item. What's on that one? Display magic, low invul invulnerability, and mass charm. You probably don't need that. Do you have any? No. Magic, scribe. You already know it. You already know it. And yep. Rampaging dragons. So I guess we don't get any more side quests. We will just leave. And I really wish that um, the area view would work, but no such luck. Someone has to do something about those dragons. They're getting on my nerves. They're not really dangerous, but they are annoying as fuck. Yeah, we go through. It doesn't matter. And from here, probably to the north. Yep, and through here, and up here, and um, no, that actually is a dead end. 
so we have to go through here. Try to head into northern direction if possible and here is another uh, space where place where the elves defend the portal. We offer help, but they decline. Okay, let's enter the palace then. Where could we go? Doesn't really make much of a difference. More orders, of course. It's just one sea dragon, really. Missed. And you're dead. That was easy. So, what do we have here? The guards at this portal have been slain. Oh, no, we will not go on. Shit. That's how they get in here. More Marauders, okay. Oh well. Good riddance. Uh. Easy as pie. It's really good to have the Ring of Reaction. Would be awesome if we would have another one for uh, Sylvia Zaint and Kobe Tai. And area view still does not work. How awesome is that? What's in here? What's that? No, that's just a uh, structure of the wall. A sleeping nest. And there happens to be a door. More marauders apparently. just one really. Behind us is nobody. Okay. You delay. You delay. That sucks. He still has 22 hit points. Did we cast a magic missile yet? Would that work underwater? Yes. Nice. Rackle, how could you miss? Just for your information, you have a Thaco of zero. You should not miss with that. Um, let's just take a look at Randy. He has a Thaco of minus two. Okay, that's a little better. She still has a uh, Sylvia has a tackle of zero, Zara Rides have a tackle of ten, let's not talk about that, she's a mage. Genevieve Julie has a tackle of eight, that's slightly better because she is stronger than uh, Zara Whites and Kobita has a tackle of ten. <sighs> Although she has a plus four sword equipped. Oh dang it. She's also relatively weak. So we are facing into western direction and there is a door to the north that doesn't lead us anywhere. So let's move on I say. Um, what is that? An armory. Most of the weapons are gone. Dragons have demo demolished it. Oh shit. I thought we could get a nice little hmm, something something. Another sea kitchen. Yeah, yeah. There's nothing here too. Good. Um, or not so good. We shall see. Um, so, um... 
What do we have here? There is a door to the north, to the west and to the south. You step into the palace of the suzerain of Nolides. All seems quiet. So okay, that is the palace. I thought the whole area was the palace. No, it's just this is the palace. The guard room, it seems empty. The music hall. Another empty guard room. What do we have here? Muttering voices, they suddenly hush. Devil Min of the Deep! Sehuajin again! Didn't we encounter some of that in. Uh, in Embarrus Gate 2? Sehuajin, I seem to remember that. 22 hit points, uh, AC of 5, uh, and a dagger. Uh, that's not really much, they have a trident here, okay. That's all actually, that's not really much. Not a lot of enemies, and this is where we came from, there can't be nobody there. So, well, what do you do? You move down. Ooh, that worked nicely. You don't do anything, you don't do anything. You son of a bee. Oh well, evil men of the sea. Not so tough if you ask me. What do we get? Money. Uh, 10 gems, okay. But uh, you are the one who takes the gems. Ah, uh, yeah, n numpad doesn't work. And item wise? Let's see whether anything is magical here. You detect? No. Then we don't really need it, do we? No, we don't. No, I don't want it. We encamp and fix and exit. And area view still does not work. Yeah, I know. A dragon is cruising nearby. I couldn't care less. Lucian's great hall. His great empty hall, they should say. So there happens to be a door here. A common room. A royal bedroom. A figure slumps from behind the door. Captain Denor! He can barely speak. Tal Hook, he whispers. The Seu Asian, stolen, sea dragon, he pants. X! He was here, looking for treasure, spoke of X. He slumps. He can say no more, what do you do? We heal. Yeah, you can cast a uh, heal spell, you don't need to use like your light wounds. Strangely, the spell has no effect. Captain Denner is under some powerful protection spell. You'll have to carry him. Fine. Then we carry him. And I guess we have to leave again. Bring him to the safe hall. More rampaging dragons. Mm-hmm. And we're actually going through here. That's probably the shortest way to leave this area. Oh, more fish. Nice. Um, Yep, so we probably have to go through here and to the west. Captain Denner stirs and you pause for a moment, his eyes open. Crucia, he murmurs. Crucia. You realize he's calling his sister. In a moment she responds. 
A vision forms of her. She is standing near a portal. There are flames all around. No, she hisses, but not to Denor. You sense the mind of someone reaching to her through the portal. With inescapable speed, the mind reaches her, jumps into Denor's eyes and regards you. The gaze upon you misses no detail. Ah, the mind whispers, heroes, good. At last, we hear chains rattle. Then Draconian screams. Then a Draconian screams at Chrysia, and the link is broken. Reason returns to Denor's face, and with it, fear. Must save her. He breathes. Then once again is asleep. Oh, you have a strange thing going on there with your sister. I gotta say that to you. I mean, you're a paladin. She apparently is a mage, but you seem to have that sort of link that. Um, Jean Grey and Cyclops had? Weird. Yeah, another dragon is cruising. I don't care. We shut. And the door is unlocked. The elves welcome you into the safe hall. Elves rush forward to bear Denor up. They lead you to where Luzern is resting. Luzern is relieved to see you. Again, I see I need not have worried. We actually were quite able to pull our own weight. What of Captain Denor? Hearing his name, Denor opens his eyes. In a hushed voice, he recounts his experiences. This is recorded as journal entry 33. Alrighty, more journal reading. Um, um hello? Where is it? Oh, here. Um, 33? Talhook. I woke. Everyone was gone. Something was wrong. I hid under the bed. Soon some sea devils came in. One was mimming around and around the room, proclaiming to the others where he would place his possessions when he came to rule. The others called him Lord Prince Talhook. Then a sea dragon arrived. I could not understand his talk, but Talhook could. You will get your eggs back when the elves are under my command, he said. Not before. Obey me or I will cook your progeny. After the dragon left, the sea devils all snickered. Oh, so the sea devils aren't evil by nature. Apparently their eggs were, their eggs were stolen and that's why they have to uh, serve the evil guys. Lysian's webbed fingers clench in anger. Prince Taluk has betrayed us. Another elf warrior speaks up. This explains the mindless cruelty of the sea dragons. They are fighting for their children. Lucian is thoughtful. We cannot hope to find Talhook. It is a big ocean. But I suspect I know where he is keeping the eggs. My people have reported strange happenings in the old city of Selanost. In particular, there is an old suit there filled with air that used to harbor outlander guests long ago. Lately, evil beings seem to be living there. They are land creatures of a type deadly to us. But fate has sent us land creatures of our own. You. If you are willing, go to Selanost and recover the sea dragon eggs. Once they are returned, the sea dragons will leave us alone. Then we can move against our, the fiend Telhook and make our city safe once more. Oh yes, I almost forgot. Your deep sea spell must be lifted to breathe air again. He pulls a small shell from a pouch. This is a Krulokon, an echoing shell. He speaks strange words into the Krulokon. It has recorded two deep sea spells, commanded to speak when you reach the air chamber, and it will lift the spell upon you. Commanded to speak again when you have the axe, and again you will breathe underwater. He hands you the Krulokon. To reach Celanos, travel east then south. A long tunnel leads to the ruined city. We have no choice but to defend ourselves and entrust you with this duty. Perform it and we will gladly transport you to the land of Teladas. Okay, we're finally getting somewhere. And this is the exit again, I think. So we will encamp and save and call it a video and continue the next one. So thank you very much for watching and we'll see each other soon. Goodbye.